I've been thinking about leaving, like Richard Price just heading off. I have. I've come at it from every angle, on good days and bad days, not just when I pissed off. And there's been a few of those days, though no more than anyone else. I'm not a special case, no matter what my dad says. And my dad says a lot, barely stops. Something to say on everything that doesn't really matter, or which clearly isn't his business. And most of it to say on me and what I'm doing, or not doing, with my one precious life. Because I've only got the one. Carrie, you've only got the one, love. As if I didn't already know. You don't want to waste it here, Carrie. Oh, he's full of shit. Obviously, he's a middle-aged man, so he's got a head start on the shitometer. I've been thinking about leaving. Do we wear de board and maze all a mad eye? But I haven't done anything. Dim and Rubeth. Yet. Dim bags packed. Dim talk and I wear de prani. Dim plan in place. I've just been thinking. I have been thinking about it though. And I could always come back if I did go. I've done it before. I could come back as often as I like. There's nothing you can't reverse in leaving, is there? The road goes both ways, doesn't it? Up and down. Out and in. I'll need something serious to make me shift, if I ever do shift. Something more than dad, if I ever get out of the garo, if I do ever leave Langain or it'll take a bomb to shift me. Some sort of huge boot up my metaphorical ass. <laughs> Someone dying? Someone pushing me a bit too far? Or someone looking into my eyes and seeing something there worth having and then and then we bugger off to pretend on the bus and catch the Cardiff train and who knows what from there.